Hi uh, guys, so another quarterback franchise in history. So we're at Lions, and it is a long. Uh, it's a. Uh, they've been long in the, in the the NFL. They've been in ninety four season with the NFL, so one of the longest franchise here, uh, from nineteen thirty to twenty twenty three. Um, right now the quarterback is Jared Goff. He's twenty eight years old. I don't know how long he'll be there. Uh, then you got Hendon Hooker. He's uh, he's injured right now. He's twenty five years old. He's injured in his ACL. Uh, then you got Adrian Martinez. He's twenty three years old, and Nate Subfield. He's twenty nine. So you got some depth and some young players that could take the uh, the um, take the, the the quarterback position after Jared Goff's gone. If they tr decide to trade him or get a better quarterback, we'll see. So let's get into it. Passing yard. Definitely number one is Matthew Stafford with 45,109 yards. Uh, he, uh, he, was, he played for the Lions 2009-2020. to 2020. He was traded for Jared Goff for, to, uh, to go uh, to the, uh, to the uh, Rams. So, Los Angeles Rams. So, number two is Bobby Lane, 15,710 yards. He played from 1950 to 1958. Number three, Scott Mitchell, 12,647 yards. He played from 1994 to 1998. Uh, number four is Greg Landry, 12,451 yards. He played from 1968 to 1978. Number five is Gary Danielson, 11,885 yards. He played from 1976 to 1984. Uh, number six is Eric Hipples, he has 10,711 yards. He played from 1980 to 1985. Jared Goff is 13 on this list. I put it on the I, I, I put his name because I think he can get it. It all depends how long he'll been playing. He he'll be playing for the Lions. So he has 7,883 yards. Uh, he's like 3,000 away from the number six. So he might get on on this list very soon. Uh, touchdown, Matthew Stafford is number one with 282 touchdown. Number two is Bobby Lane with 118 touchdown. Number three, Greg Landry with 80 touchdown. Number four, Scott Mitchell with 79 touchdown. Number five, Gary Danielson with 69 touchdown. Number six is Joey Harrington, 60 touchdown. He played from 2002 to 2005. Uh, Jared Goff is 12 on the list with 48 touchdowns. He will get on this list, I think. All depends how much games he'll play. Uh, quarterback wins. Matthew Stafford is number one there too with 74 wins. Bobby Lane, 53 wins. Greg Landry with 40 wins. Eric Hippel with 28 wins. Number four, number five, Scott Mitchell with 27 wins. And number six, Bill Monson. 24 wins he played from 1968 to 1975. Jared Goff is 13 on that list with 12 wins. All depends how the Lions. I think the Lions will get better this year. If they get better, he'll get more wins and he'll be on this list, I think. All depends how the Lions goes, but their division looks like it's wide open. So for the Lions, it's wide open for them. Uh, completion, you got Matthew Stafford with 3,898. Completion, number two is Bobby Lane with 1,074 completion. Scott Mitchell, number three with 1,049 completion. Joey Arrington with 986 completion. Number five, Greg Landry with 957 completion. Number six is Gary Danielson with 952 completion. And number, uh, so Jared Goff is number 11 with 714. He'll get a little bit on this list, I think. Uh, Matthew Stafford probably will be on the Rams list in the future, or he's already in there. I didn't do the list yet, but I think he'll get on this list. He did get injured, though, this year, last year, so we'll see if he gets on that list. But he's definitely staying on the Lions list for a uh, long, long, long time. So let me let me know in the comments below if you think Jared Goff will pass, uh, be on this list on uh, top six. If not, uh, who you think will? Maybe one of these guy, young guys. Uh, but I don't think Matthew Stafford. I think his 
Uh, his numbers are safe for number one, but we'll never know. So let me know when it comes to what you think. Like and subscribe. Thank you for all your support, and I'll see you soon with more videos. See you guys.